What is going on everybody? Today we found a 2013 Prevo Outlaw H345 quad slide bath and a half that is listed at the motor coach store for $888,888, making this the least expensive quad slide bath and a half Prevo H3 on the market. Now, those of you that have followed the channel know I'm a huge fan of Emerald Luxury Coaches out of Stephenville, Texas. Emerald actually is a sister company or a partner company of of Outlaw Conversions, which is a well-known company in the equestrian and the living quarters horse trailer world. Now in the 2000s, Outlaw started converting Prevo buses. And then around like 2016, 2017, sometime around that time, they started Emerald Luxury Coaches. So you're gonna see a lot of the same DNA in this Outlaw quad slide that you're gonna see in the new Prevo Emerald Luxury Coaches today. Now this coach is a 2013 conversion Version, but it's on a 2008 Prevo shell. So this coach does not have DEF, which is a huge advantage. And then a lot of you out there I know are big fans of the Series 60. Today we're hanging out in downtown Sarasota. We thought we'd bring this coach out by the bay to get you guys some cool shots. Let's open up these bays. The bay doors were locked, but I just pressed one button up there and then that unlocks all of these bays. And check out how quickly I get all these opened up. I'm a big fan at how Emerald finishes out their bays. So this first bay up front here, I mean, this could be a condo inside of this bay, not really, but you could easily crawl into this bay. Lots of storage. The H3 has the tallest storage bays in the industry. It's a full pass through bay. And then you do have some components housed in this bay, but you also have a manual slide tray here. I like that it's manual, less stuff that can break. And then it's a lower profile than some of the other slide trays out there making loading and unloading very easy. You've got another big slide tray lined with carpet in very good condition. These bays are very clean. Here we've got quad outback inverters. I love how Emerald labels everything very neatly. You've got your breakers here. A lot of your electronic components neatly placed there. Here's your outside entertainment area. This is a big option. This, this is on a slide tray. You've got your LG TV with a Sono sound bar. And then a nice little sink up here, countertop space, nice little entertainment area here. We've got your plumbing bay with that big industrial, like a marine grade water pump, as well as an auxiliary water water pump. I like seeing that. Now I'm looking for the date codes on these tires and I'm not seeing them. Sometimes those date codes are on the inside of these tires. One of the best parts about this coach is it's available at the motor coach store in Bradenton, Florida. So you can find the check-in sheet, the build sheet online at the motorcoachstore.com where they're going to have the date codes on the tires, the batteries. They are very transparent with all of the information and they provide that on their website. Talking about all all of those processes you know the motor coach store is a dealership that focuses on having the best processes the best people they really operate on another level I mean, everything from the detail process to the PDI process the processes at how we film these coaches to your delivery process when you take delivery you can spend a day or two days learning how to use this coach you can camp the night in the coach to make sure you understand all of the systems Really, the Motor Coach Store is a boutique type dealership, and you can expect a completely different experience than what you would receive at a big box RV store. So let's keep taking a look at this coach. Now, this has the Series 60, one of the most sought after motors in the trucking industry, in the RV industry. You've got your Wabasto heater back here, and you can get a side look at that Series 60 there. And then as I open this engine hatch up, I want to point out that emerald styling up top there, that rear cap. This is an outlaw, but that's the same styling that Emerald is using. Really a timeless design. And I really think Emerald has the best looking front and rear caps out of all of the Prevo converters out there. This coach has the updated front end with the more updated headlights that they used on 
the new Prevos all the way up until the new body style just got released just a month or two ago. So typically when it's an 08 chassis with the Series 60, it's gonna have the older round headlights. So that's a very expensive upgrade and definitely gives this a more modern look. Uh, now here's a back look of the Detroit Diesel Series 60. You've got a belt tensioner here. All of your belts are very easy to get to. And keep in mind that a lot of these Prevo buses are used as either seated passenger buses or tour buses hauling around the A-list celebrities. So it's very important that these are reliable, easy to fix, and easy to keep going down the road. And that's why so many of these have a million plus miles on them. And there's a reason that this is the most chosen bus in the entertainer industry. And I love to point out, you know, how flush these slide rooms are. When you look at other motorhomes out there, they're not gonna have a fully flush slide from the slide rooms to the windows up top, just totally flush, just a really good look. I love this plumbing bay here, the style of it. You've got a simple manifold system, brushed aluminum look here, little spot for paper towels, little spot to wash your hands. Everything is very simple. And then you can see your holding tanks are back there, all neatly plumbed, very clean. So here's your electronics bay. You've got your 50 amp cord reel, a separate battery for the generator. This does have the 20 kW generator, does have this manual tray, the slide master tray to make servicing easier. And look at how clean these airbags are. All of the sound detonating material is very clean, in good condition. You can see it's got the fire suppression system here. Here's the other side of that storage bay. Looks like some of your outlaw owner's manuals, actually. I like that. All the RVIA sheets, too. And then in this front bay up here, you've got a little spot to store your outlaw coach lawn chairs. Ladies and gentlemen, I think I want to just take a seat in this lawn chair. I think I could sit out here all day and enjoy this beautiful view here in Sarasota, Florida. But we've got a really cool coach to show you guys. So let's go take a look inside. Welcome to this 2013 Quad Slide Outlaw Coach. This is a timeless design, and those of you that have seen the videos that I've done on the newer Emerald Coaches, you're gonna see a lot of the same kind of DNA and styling that comes from the Outlaw conversion. So they're really known for their reputation of building high quality units, and this Quad Slide H3 is no exception. Yes, yeah, so you've got the dual opposing sofas, and I like the two tones. You You've got the almost a saddle color leather, and this reminds me of the style of leather that you're gonna see in the King Ranch Ford F-350s with that button tough back. Everything is in very good condition. You've got the rounded edge here. So if you wanna put that TV down up there, it'll give you a nice angle. Now right now we do have all of the blinds open. It's about five in the morning right now. We're getting an early morning shoot in. So we can close all of these blinds, which gives it a real nice look. Let me just press one button and do that for you real quick. So you can see all of the blinds are in excellent condition. You can really tell this coach has been well cared for. I'm not seeing any unusual wear and tear. All the blinds came down in sync and I love this lighting around the windows. Now Emerald does have a booth and a lot of people are big fans of the booth floor plan. Very comfortable, nice size. And these wall panels are very similar to what we're seeing in the new Emerald coaches. And I did get a chance to visit the Emerald Factory in Stephenville, Texas. John Walker, the CEO of Emerald Luxury Coaches and Outlaw Conversions is a class act. Just a lot of great people over at Emerald in Stephenville, Texas. A lot of their philosophy is to build a simple coach. They try to dumb down the systems, make it easy to work on, easy to access everything. And there's a lot of cool stuff like these wall panels, I know it's very easy for them to remove these wall panels. If you wanted to get them rewrapped in a different color leather, they're very reasonable. I had a buddy actually that had a 2011 Outlaw H3 double slide, took it to Emerald and had a full remodel done, made it like brand new. And with the structure of this Prevo H3, you know, these shells alone are probably pushing on the cost of this coach new. And a lot of people really prefer the pre 
DEF. This has the Detroit Diesel Series 60. Just a great overall package. But let's keep looking through this coach. I want to point out the woodwork on the ceiling. You've got these leather panels with squares and diamonds. A lot of cool stuff going on on the ceiling. Then you're probably noticing this cocktail glass cabinet behind me. You've got your wine glasses and then your cocktail glasses here. I like it when they do the little touches like that etched glass there. And then you've got this nice area to set those so that they won't rattle while they're going down the road. And coming back up here to the opposing sofa up here, I want to point out the cool little two-tone panels that they're doing with the cream leather and then the more chocolate brown leather. I like that they broke it up, really ties everything together. This will turn into sleeping. This is a villa sofa. This does actually inflate and deflate here. It's an air mattress, really easy. And then when you have the slide rooms out, you still have a walkway here. Being a quad slide coach, really a lot of livability. And this is a bath and a half coach too. So if you do have guests, there is that bathroom up front. Easy peasy. And I love that button tough back here. And this sofa does not have sleeping, but you do have this pull out drawer here with some storage. And if someone maybe did want to lay down on that couch, they probably could utilize that space. Love these uh, slide room faces with that wood look. And then you do have storage here. It's almost like a suede inside of these cabinets. I think that is real suede, very high end materials, very well lit inside the cabinets as well. You can see it's very bright. And then this coach has the big panels where you can control your different systems in the coach. It does have the Sono speakers. Take a look in the gallery here again well lit all lined with suede here you've got your avantia microwave and i like that they tuck that back behind these cabinet doors to give you a nice clean look so you're not looking at those appliances you've got adjustable shelving there and suede lined interior i don't know if i've seen suede i think that's extremely expensive that uh alcantara i don't know if that's the alcantara but that looks like the same stuff they're putting on the headlines of the you know quarter million dollar cars and up this does have the mele cooktop with this solid surface countertop cover to give it a nice flush look and a sink cover as well. I love the hardware, almost like a Western or a rustic theme inside of this coach. Then you've got storage below your sink, Fisher Pickel dishwasher, nice big deep drawer there for pots and pans. Now, one thing that I think could be done with this coach that would really update it and take it to the next level would be updated floors. And these floors aren't bad. There's a lot going on. You've got this tile inlay, really cool style, really cool pattern. But if someone were to maybe Maybe put some wood floors through this whole coach. That is something that the motor coach store can do. So if you do want to purchase this coach and have all new floors put in, they are very reasonable. Or if you want to have your coach remodeled, you can always reach out to the motor coach store service department and get quotes on remodeling these coaches. They're definitely used to working on these high-end coaches and there's a lot of value in having skilled technicians that are familiar with these coaches do that type of remodel work. Sometimes I forget to go over the audio video. I don't watch a lot of TV. I'm more on YouTube and that kind of stuff. But you do have the TV inside of the slide room here. So when you put the slide rooms in, you could still see this TV while you're going down the road if you do have passengers back here. And then there is another big TV that will fold down up front when you are stationary. You do have the Sono sound bar. You've got your coffee maker below your liquor cabinet. Nice little countertop area. And this is another little detail I like that Emerald does. You have more countertop space back here behind your booth. So if you want to set an extra drink or set something down, always nice to have that countertop space. And then I keep seeing these Sono speakers throughout the coach. And then the refrigerator is finished out with that same wood face like we've seen on the cabinets. And a little spot up here to store some of your components, your wine guard, your direct TV. And then they've got the water and ice dispenser on the refrigerator door, all super clean. And I love these simple wall panels with the straight lines, a lot of storage here. You've got these big pull out drawers, very tall. Now I wonder if this could be utilized as like a washer dryer or if but this is just a very large space that I think could have dual use. I don't see that it's pre-plumbed for a washer dryer, but if you want to do remodel work, they can do all kinds of stuff. I've seen them add half bathrooms, adjust bed sizes. They're capable of doing all kinds of stuff in the service department at the motor coach store. You've got a really good size half bathroom here. I love the tile floors in the half bathroom. I would not change these for sure. And then these wall panels, I really like 
the square tiles with like a gold metallic look. Plenty of room. You've got that hammered copper sink. Kind of a small sink, but beautiful rounded woodwork here to make getting out of this half bath very easy. Beautiful wall panels, even on the inside of the door. I don't know if you can see that mirror behind your toilet with storage. Again, suede lining inside of that cabinet. And then across from our half bathroom, you've got a really good size closet here. I like that kind of pivoting door. Again, lined with suede, well lit. And then below that, you've got these drawers here. And this is next level, all suede on the face of these drawers and suede on the inside of these drawers. This is a very high-end coach. Coming back into the bedroom here, this bedroom has something that I really like and I think all bedrooms should have a spot to sit down in your bedroom. Maybe if you want to put on your shoes, you've got this like button tough bench here below your LG TV with the Sono sound bar. This is a really big TV for inside your bedroom as well. But I'm a big fan of having this little space here. Beautiful woodwork here, beautiful accent lighting, really cool vibe inside of this rear bedroom. And then they did something a little bit different on the ceiling here. It's like that same tile work we saw on the floor inlay they brought into the ceiling of the bedroom, giving it a really nice feel. And then this bed is kind of tilted a little bit here, giving you easier access when you're getting through the coach, pointed more at the TV and then we've got those blinds down right now with that big Prevo window and I like that there's no cabinets above your bed giving you a lot of headspace a lot of room in this master suite and again just beautiful woodwork throughout this coach those beautiful leather panels and you've got more storage here again lined with suede and a lot of hanging space this goes pretty deep here and now this is a floor plan that was way ahead of its time if you look at the more recent model Prevo conversion a lot of them are going to be doing the bath and a half, which this is a 2013. So to find a bath and a half in this price point, especially in a quad slide H is very rare. I really like this style and I like the positioning of this shower here. So you've got these beautiful floors and I would not change these. I love the style of these floors. And then you've got like that teak kind of wood inlay on the shower floor. Beautiful. That same tile work on the ceiling, on the walls. You You've got plenty of room here in your shower, beautiful glass shower door, and this glass is all in good condition. I'm not seeing any water spots. You can tell the owner really cared for this coach. I guess this is like a little bench. It's a pretty narrow bench, but if you do want to take a seat while you're in your shower, that is an option, and then little spots to set stuff here. That same hardware that matches what we saw in the kitchen. And with this rear bath layout, you have plenty of room around your Tecma toilet, and this is something that I'm excited about, the inlay on this bench bathroom door here, really cool. Then you have your hammered copper sink, and I really like, this kind of matches that teak wood on the floor. There's almost a little bit of a marine style in this coach, and then that same tile black splash. And you do have a vent with a fan back here with this cool aesthetic piece covering that up, and a lot of room back here. Storage area with more hanging space. So if you are in the market for a quad slide Prevo H3 bath and a half, this coach is a great opportunity. It's currently available at the Motor Coach Store in Bradenton, Florida for $888,888, making it the cheapest or least expensive bath and a half quad slide H3 on the market right now. Serious and qualified buyers can contact Bradley Twait at the Motor Coach Store. I greatly appreciate all of you subscribing to the channel and liking these videos. I hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again. Mm -hmm.